Hello everyone, how are you doing? Welcome to Game Tech UK. Welcome back to a bit of sanity. We've just finished streaming Priest Simulator, which was totally off the scale. And now we're back onto Construction Simulator. We're going to carry on with the public square. Just chill out for a couple of hours. Um, probably about an hour and a half, actually. Um, I've got a tip run to do this afternoon, so I've got to take some stuff to the uh, the tip in the car. But yes, about an hour and a half, just chilling out on one of my favourite games at the moment. Um, just, uh, yeah... Woody Woodside, how are ya? <laughs> Back to some sort of normality, yes. Yeah, let me just uh, double check that I've ticked that. But yes, just um, have a chill out this afternoon. Let me get that up. And... Bosh, yeah, so what we've got to do, we've got to go and get some uh, pallet of concrete elements. And we're carrying on here. Uh, we're 66 per 66% through this... Um, uh, through this uh, job as well. So yeah, all good. Let me say some names. I know there's not many of you in straight away. Um, sometimes YouTube goes a bit funny. If you do one stream and then you do one straight after, sometimes it doesn't send the notification out. That's why it's always handy to have that bell ticked so you know um, when I go live every time because sometimes I do consecutive streams and YouTube sort of gets a bit funny about recommending every stream. Yeah, Mook, yeah, I will, I will. Right, who have we got in? Hello, Tanner, how are you? Hello, buddy. We got Cupra, we got Mook, Stephen, Woody Woodside, how are you? Hello, Carl, how are you? We got Jay Bird. Yeah, it was absolute nuts, wasn't it? Crazy. But I sort of liked it. I mean, I really liked it. Hello, Jimbo. Hello, Jake, how are you? Mr. Din. Uh, Willow, how are you, Willow? So I just had a little pork and stuffing sandwich and a bag of Thai sweet chilli bloody Chris, and now I've got a nice cup of tea and I'm happy to spend the next hour and a half with you lovely people. Let's do it. Okay, so we're going to go up to um, the shop. Um, we need six concrete elements. Concrete elements. One, two, three, four, five, six. I'll get them sent to the construction site as well. Why not? That seems uh, realistic to do that. So they're over there. I think to... Um, should we use our crane? Where's our crane gone? How big are they? Yeah. I think we'll use the yellow crane because then we can do it all in one then. That'll extend across there, won't it? Yeah, let's do that. It was fun, uh, Mr. Priest. Yeah, it was, it was shockingly fun. <coughs> Hello Zero, how are you? I haven't had a chance to do anything on here, so I haven't done anything off stream here. I haven't done any gaming at the weekend, because I was uh, painting. But now, we're back on. Right, what I think we'll do is... Oh, we haven't got to fill those in? Hmm, because we finished the last stream by putting the saplings in, didn't we? Oh, don't go in there. This is just, this isn't just weird enough, yeah, I know. Yeah, no worries, Mook. Nice to see you, mate. Right, if we go at this sort of angle, then we should um, be able to do it like that. I did, Jake. Yeah, I got all my painting done, actually. Yeah, but yeah, I worked all day Saturday, right up until bedtime, all day Sunday. Um, uh, but yeah, it's all done. Yeah, which is awesome. So we've got a nicely, freshly decorated kitchen that the wife's very happy with. We haven't like replaced cupboards or anything like that. It was only like a, um, just like a refresh. But yeah, she's at me, I'm at me, and I can get back to gaming now. <laughs> Hello, Stephen R. How are you? Yeah, that was uh, absolutely weird priest simulator but I do you know I do love to show you stuff that you might not have noticed or know about you know I consider it my job really to bring you stuff so you can go oh my god I didn't know that was out well now you do bloody love streaming with you absolutely love it What's Jimbo saying? Let me put it on there. I don't, I'm not getting all of the... Um... It is cold out there, yeah. Yeah, it is cold, actually, Stephen. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> yes, it is cold. I had the aircon on in the last stream, and it wasn't until I come out of the room. I was like, bloody hell, why am I so cold? And it's cold out here as well. Yeah. 
Yeah, but it's the favourite time of year as well, isn't it? Autumn and then winter, you know. Hello, Ali. How are you? It's, it's, it's a favourite time of the year for me anyway. I know a lot of people don't like it. My missus don't like the winter, but I do. Gamers like the winter, don't they? Is the sound okay, by the way? <laughs> do the fires of hell not warm you up? <laughs> It was a very good laugh, uh, especially when uh, all the bits happen for the first time. I'm just like, wow, this is... Uh, I appreciate stuff like that, though, don't you? I like different. I like different in films, in music. Um, why not in games? Yeah. I, I like to embrace stuff like that. I'm not saying I play it all the time, but I, I think it deserves a well done just for trying something different. Yeah, I think it will probably will be a bit quiet, actually, because I turned it down for the previous one. Yeah. Hello, Shane. How are you? <laughs> Hence watching this channel. Yeah. Fair point. Fair point. Well made, Barbara. Hello, Glenn. How are you? But this, I can't get enough of construction sim. I want to complete all these jobs. And you seem to like watching them as well. So, it's win-win. If you haven't already, please leave me a little cheeky like. Like I say, for some reason, YouTube doesn't like giving notifications for consecutive streams. It's always a bit funny like that. Unless you've ticked the bell and put all notifications on. When I do a stream straight afterwards, it's always quieter in the second stream, always. <laughs> Just ended up with more. Yeah, maybe Scud, maybe, yeah. It's um, it's looking quite good. Apparently it's been in the works for a long time as well. And not finished the EU, yeah. Oh, there's loads of content here, isn't there? Well, you know, game content. I won't be doing the tip run in my car, will I, Stephen? One of your streams a day is enough, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but if, I, if I'm if i not done, or a stream's a little bit shorter than I first thought, I'm always up for another one. Always. Which means that you know I enjoy it. Oh, cool, we've got to do it like this. Oh, nice. Well, we'll have some of that, won't we? So you just chill out. Hopefully this is um, helping you through your Monday. Monday already. Did you all have a good weekend, by the way? Uh, turn 50. Need some around to help me through my latest trauma. Yeah, I mean, I was worried about turning 50. I was worried about turning 40, and then suddenly the next day I realised that I didn't feel any different, and actually it's all right, and what are we worried about? So I would say the same thing to you. Unless you feel dramatically different, does it actually matter? It's about how you... Behave and conduct yourself, and it's you as a person, not as a number. Don't be defined by a number. I've got no problem being 50 now, actually. Got COVID, oh, Crusader, yeah. You look like you're in your 20s. Well, I don't know about that. I certainly don't feel 50, that's for sure. I'm sure Stephen doesn't either.
I just love it because the uh, all the missions are so time consuming and it's, it's a nice thing to do. Age is just a number, yes, yeah. Hello, uh, plays, how are you, mate? You're 35 and feel 50. Yeah, but just think how young you'll feel when you are 50. He had three um, extra grey hairs. Well, some people were grey in their 20s, so again, you know, I wouldn't worry about it. I was uh, I was 47 for two years, uh, number 55, uh, genuinely, because I thought I was 47. I was actually 46, so I genuinely thought I was 47, but it turned out I was 46. I said it so many times on the stream, I'm going to be 47 this year. Uh, or 48 this year and it was like I kept saying it and I think because I kept saying it it just become fact in my mind and it wasn't until I, I said it in front of a mistress she's like you're 46 you'll be 47 oh brilliant I've just got a year <laughs> I've just gained a year I was 47 for two years in my mind <laughs> shame Twist this round. Oh, 69 watching. <laughs> 20 pound and an old pair of jeans, I know, I know. Who cares about age anyway? Well, as my wife keeps reminding me, she's in her 40s, I'm in my 50s. <laughs> I got a message through the other day. Uh, I said to her, have you got the text through about like your COVID reminder? And she went, no, that's for over 50s. <laughs> I was like, oh, shit. <laughs> Thank you, Willow. How are you, mate? How are you getting on recovering? Hello, Pete. How was Cyprus, Pete? Or are you still over there? Oh, 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 dominoes. Look at that. Wow, proper physics. Awesome. Do you remember Domino Rally? Did you ever have that when you were young? I didn't have the official domino rally. I had to make it out of Lego, and they don't fall over as well, do they? Brilliant weather. Oh, lovely. Are you, are you still there now, Pete? Or Well, enjoy it, mate, because you know what it's like. You'll soon be back. And when you get back, it's going to be cold, trust me. It's cold here at the moment. We're on the turn. Pretty sweet graphics though, isn't it? Yeah, maybe not that cold, Pete, but you, you'll definitely feel it. Hello, True. Yeah, I'm alright, mate. I'm just chilling out now with all that fun and frolicking from Priest Simulator we just finished. Wow. That was, uh, that was heavenly, wasn't it? Some of the lines in that, though. Brilliant. Any priest said no, Alex. How are you? It's funny as fuck, though, wasn't it? I like this mobile crane. It's really handy. God, 
God's sake. How are you, ninja? Yes, yeah, so I hope you're doing well. I hope you had a lovely, lovely weekend. Hope you've left me a little cheeky like. Other than that, just chill out. Did you miss it, Drew? You missed a, you, you missed a, something quite unique. <laughs> right, we've got two more bits of concrete that are going to get unpacked when we lay this uh, next bit, I think. Oh, it's a lovely game, Alex. One of my favourite games recently. It, it really is. Clear the marked area. That's it. Got more to put in. Not sure what this is actually going to be. Oh, no, that's, that's a flat bit, isn't it? No, I don't think we're doing that yet. Oh, thank you, Jake. Yeah, I appreciate you all, uh, you all being here. We need to drop that. We need one of these ones at the end, I think. Yeah, people seem to like watching it, and the streams are... I mean, not this one, but the streams are usually busy. So, I enjoy playing it. It's win-win, isn't it? <laughs> Not that you ever see a priest, only on Sunday. It's worth flicking through, true. That's for sure. Just to just to see a bit of different development these days going on. It's still nice to know that the creativity is alive. That's for sure. Don't you agree with that, though? I mean, it's nice to know that people are still making games that are outside the box. something really fun and relaxing about doing this. I could literally play this game for hours, which I do, as you well know. Oh, they, oh these are steps, aren't they? Okay. Yeah, Goat Simulator 3 was at EGX, but I didn't even look at it, to be fair. Well, we're just building a public square at the moment. So I don't know exactly what he wants done, but we're just following instructions. Actually, I think after this one, we'll be on his final mission, won't we? other steps up I think. Walk straight past and play played uh, pull instead. Instead of what Glenn? Sorry, is that the right message? Right window? <laughs> See you later Stephen. School run already? Yeah, I've got to finish about, in about an hour, I'm going to load the car up and do a tip run. Just got some stuff from the weekend to get rid of in the garden. Oh, I got you, Glenn. Sorry, yeah, yeah. See you later, Stephen. Woody Woodside.
What happened to the other game? I stopped watching it as it was not my type of game. Well, you don't want to know what happened then, do you, Mark? <laughs> We just finished it up. I felt like a bit of construction sim. A bit of normality. to do with this. You're at work, Glenn, or you got a day off? You're going to church, aren't you, Stephen? Hello. Hello, Stephen. <laughs> Oh god, we've got more to do. Yeah, I like this crane though, it's good. Whoops, a daisies. Oh, I've got you, Glenn. Well, hopefully this is helping your Monday afternoon go a little bit sweeter. Hopefully you're all chilled out, whether you're at work, whether you're at home, whether you're playing games in the background or whether you're just doing jobs, whatever it is you're doing, I'm happy to have you here. Hopefully you've left me a little cheeky like, because that doesn't cost anything, so I don't mind asking for that. I don't ask for anything else, just a little like. Maybe a share if you're feeling generous. I've got a sore throat today, which is why I'm not talking as much as I normally do. Plus, this is quite a chilled out sort of experience in it anyway, isn't it? So it sort of matches that, really. Hello, Joseph, how are you? So are you working, Joseph? I know you said you were 25, didn't you, after we met you the other night on Zoom, um, in our member Zoom. Are you uh, working at the moment, or are you studying? What are you doing? don't think I've asked you, though. So 73% through this um, mission anyway, so we haven't got a huge amount to do. Hello, Big Jacko. How are you, mate? Posh. Oh, we're going to put saplings in there. Cool. Okay, let's move this out. We can use our smaller one for that, really. Well, I suppose, actually, why? No, no. No, let's leave that exactly where it is, because we can do exactly the same system. I was thinking, do I need to use a big crane for saplings? But we might as well. So, how many do we need? Five. Five saplings, please. And we'll get that sent to the construction site, because why not? I'm lazy. What's your favourite flavour Pringle? Probably, um, uh, put, put, there's a lot of Pringles there. Um, probably barbecue. Yeah, although I like barbecue and most stuff. Yeah, me too, Jacko. It's great, isn't it? Who's actually completed this job? Paprika. Paprika pr prickles. <laughs> Not salt and vinegar. No, I don't like that. Yeah, bacon's nice, yeah. 
did you hear that Quality Street? Now, is it Quality Street? Yeah, you know Quality Street. They're changing their wrappers this year because they're made of plastic, and it's good what they're doing actually. Because obviously, each year, so many of them bloody get chucked away. But it's going to be interesting because uh, when you open that Quality Street for the first time, all the colours and the smell—it's almost like you can actually smell the plastic as well as the sweets. It's going to be interesting what they do this year. You have Willow. Oh, nice. And Jake's done it as well. Yeah, it's good that they're doing it. Hello, Mick. Are you telling me you didn't fully understand what was going on with pre-simulator? George, your ass up to your elbow. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, I like any barbecue-flavoured anything, really. I think most people go for celebrations now anyway at Christmas, don't they? I mean, Quality Street, all right, but you get Quality Street. With celebrations, you get a bit of everything, don't you? Hello, Gordon. Bloody sore throat, just on the right-hand side as well. I better have this before it goes cold. Yeah, I love playing and streaming this game, it's so nice. Makes me chilled out, you know, which is uh, which is one of the things I want from gaming. I like I like it when gaming chills me out and it just relaxes you. It's my sort of uh, downtime, if you like. Oh. How are you, Gordon? Yeah, the old PC version does seem to be fairly bug-free, doesn't it? I will complete the um, the the Euro map before going over to PlayStation and doing the American map on there. Maybe by the time that's happened, the PlayStation will be in a better condition as well, so that'll be perfect. The new cold will spike my rage. Have you brought it, um, Shane? Oh, that's good, Jake. Yeah, I mean, I tried it on everything, and it run, it run absolutely okay. It was all right, Gordon. Yeah, it was a lot of fun, a lot of fun actually. Palette of uh, paving stones. Don't know why I can't talk today or any day really. Ordered it last week. Yeah. No, Jack. I know it all seems to be pretty good, doesn't it? Right, what are we going to do with these paving stones? Oh, we've got to put them over there first, haven't we? Whoa. Love this crane. Look at the graphics, though. It's so cool, isn't it? I think they've done really well with this. Very, very well. <coughs> <laughs> they pulled a funny face, did they? There we go. At least doing it with the big crane, we know we can get the reach. Oh, nice Gordon. I would get it, but I think I'm going to stick with Battlefield, actually. Not that I'm much of a first-person shooter person anyway. Oh, wrong way. 
Yeah, it's not the same developer though, Big Jacko. Same publisher, but not the same developer. Completely different team. But Astragon always seem to publish decent games. They publish fewer games, but what they publish is actually half decent. Well, very good. They don't seem to just publish anything and hope that something sticks. They, uh, they seem to... Not as much, but what they do is uh, is good. <laughs> they didn't listen to their community. Is it any good? Is it worth getting, or is it just the, the same? Is it just the same shame? Is it crossplay? I have to play shooters on PC, keyboard, and mouse. Can't do that on controller. I just haven't got the reaction time to it these days, I just really haven't. Oh, it's not actually out yet, Shane. Yeah, I got gotcha. you. Oh, bloody hell. Oh, oh, look out. Yeah, if you haven't already, please leave me a little like, because um, it will help out. And maybe a little share if you're feeling generous, but that's up to you. There we go. Clear the construction side. See, we've got to get out of the way. It'll buff out, yeah. Thanks, Gordon. We're only here, um, oh god, we're only here for about another 35 minutes. It's a slightly shorter construction sim stream, but I'll be back tomorrow. We're going to do some more racing tomorrow on ACC on console. We enjoyed that the other night, that was good. What you build actually stays, yeah, you can drive past it, can't you? And, and go and have a look at it, yeah, I like that aspect. Shame you can't go in there. Like when you're building the, the hotel, for example, for this same bloke, w when you're building it, you can go in there. But when it's built, you can't go in there. But yeah, it's fine. Oh, hang on a minute. No, that's not good. I I would love the um the opportunity to lay them, wouldn't you? It's just sort of taken that from me. That's a shame. Uh, dispose of scrap. Broken church. Where is it? Oh, it's up there. Oh, okay. Oh, cool. Okay. Well, let's take the crane up there, I'm guessing. Oh, I don't think so, Jacko, but we can get around it by just doing private um, servers, you know. It's a bit like Battlefield. I like the idea of COD. I'd like to get into it, but I just know that it's going to be not very good for streaming. It's just going to be kill, die, 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 die. Oh, kill. Oh, maybe a double kill. Die, 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 die more frustration oh fuck's sake you know um so i probably won't this is weird isn't it it's like it's not even on the same site though is it it's almost like it's a separate job i'm guessing we've got it. Can, can you get out of the way seriously get out of the way get out oh whoops the daisies Need a truck to put the bell in, yeah. No spoilers though. <laughs> See if we can get it from there. We might have to go back further actually. Oh, there's a collectible there as well. That's all right, Jake. Are the driving physics as good as SnowRunner? Probably, no, not driving physics aren't they, but oh fucking hell, it's not really a sort of driving game as such is it? Will this actually reach it? I know I've got a... I'm going to have to go back aren't I, but will it actually reach it? 
Yeah, it's only there. Okay, we need to go back. Gonna have to block the road, ladies and gents. Look at all that up there with the castle as well. Yeah, SnowRunner is all about the physics. This isn't about the physics. This is about the job of construction. So it's slightly different and maybe an unfair comparison. But I would say vehicle physics are on par with farming sim. Absolutely. But it hasn't got the same as, as SnowRunner, no. Hello, Harold. How are you? Sorry about my throat, by the way. I've got on the right-hand side. It's proper... Do you ever get that where you get a sore throat on one side of your throat? That's the way she fucking goes. <laughs> Um, that's it. Okay, I have to go a bit closer. I think this this truck will do it. If not, we'll just set a um, maybe an external crane up, maybe. Try that. No, 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 there. Yeah, we get on. You need a bigger mobile crane. We'll see. I haven't yet, co um, uh, Conan, uh, Harold. I haven't logged in yet. I didn't do anything over the weekend. No, we can do this. We just need to move forward a little bit. Got to be precise. Yeah, but do you get it when you've only got a um, sore throat on one side of your throat? It's weird. Yeah, I was decorating all weekend, so I didn't get a chance to do any gaming at all. <laughs> That's what she said. I think we're too close now. We might be alright. Might be alright. Oh, bloody hell. Whoops. Oh, the physics are actually working now. Oh, shit. I'm caught up. Uh, I'm actually caught up. Oh god. Right, let's reset. I think this is the right position actually, but we'll see. We'll fully extend our tool. Oh my god. Come on. Come on. Fucking <laughs> okay hell. Well, that's annoying, isn't it? I still think we can do it, so we'll try it a little bit closer. <laughs> Just a tiny, tiny bit. <laughs> we probably do need another one, but you know me. You know me. 
Big Jacko, thank you very much, mate. I appreciate that. Thank you for your support. Welcome, mate. You get put into a giveaway each month for free £10 vouchers, and um, you get a members-only stream each month as well. You're not long enough. Well, I'll just think nice thoughts, and I'll get a bit extra out of it. <laughs> thank you, Jacko. I mean, it looks like I've got loads of room, doesn't it? I think we'll be all right now. Yeah, I think we'll be all right. Oh, come on. What the f... <laughs> no, I'm using the camera, that's it. Come on! You can do this! You can do it! I'll knock the bloody thing off. Oh god, I'm making it harder. That's what she says. Okay, well, I'm sorry, but we're in this now. Oh, thanks, Jacko. I like being in, mate. This time. <laughs> what, what was the saying in there? Fucking. Oh, what was it again? Oh, God, it's gone from my mind. There's fucking. There she goes. <laughs> I think we'll be right this time. See, never give up. Never give up. Oh, cool. <laughs> oh, cool. <laughs> there she, that's the way she fucking goes. It is a bell end, yes, yes. Right, so we need the um, the truck, I'll take it, from what you're saying. He who dares robbers. So this is something a little bit different, isn't it? I never do the um, traffic lights in this game because I don't want to drive in this game. I want to construct. I want to do construction. Whoa, nice drift. You might need one without signs, yeah, yeah, we'll see. Yeah, they are really good for a um, an indie game, aren't they? Really good. Yeah, having to go to another area, yeah. Yeah, it's weird because it's like... Unless we're going to do something with the bell, what connection is it... I mean, no spoilers, but what connection has it got to the job that we're currently doing? That's what I'm a bit confused about. Seems a bit weird that we're seventy-seven percent. I got a feeling that it's going to be on display or something. Surely, that's what I'm thinking. We'll go straight over the roundabout. <laughs> Don't worry about. Oh, 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 fucking hell! I hit my head. It's fine. Of course, it's fine. There's one of them pipes in Snowrunner, actually, isn't there? I'll let you find out. Yeah, I'm, my guess is, is that it's going to be on display almost like it was the, um, 
you know, the old broken church bell. <coughs> My voice is getting worse. Hang on, that's taken me to the builder's yard. What are you doing? Oh, what? Oh, you got to put it there. Okay. Right, we've got to put it there. What's the one? Oh, you're going to pick up a new one. Right, okay. Okay, that's fine. Uh, that's the public square. Let's go... Uh, okay, let, let, let's uh, fast travel back there. Yeah, see, I was following the white line, but the white line took me to the end goal. How are well, you, Kim? How was your weekend? That's it, it's up here, isn't it? Hello, Ariel. Ar Ariel? Ariel. Oh, so we'll say Ariel. Let's, let's go with that. I did, Kim, yeah, I worked all day Saturday right up until um, bedtime, all day Sunday, right up until bedtime, everything's done, kitchen looks lovely. Hello Felix, how are you mate? How old is he, um, Ariel? Yes, I'll work my bollocks off and... Willow, do you get this? I know you take blood thinning tablets like I do. Um, oh, I can't go all the way around. They make you so sore in your bones because you you bruise easy when you're on blood. I'm on quite a serious blood thinner because um, I've had the stents fitted. But they make oh god, I'm aching so much. Like, I mean, yeah, I did work hard and bending and squatting and kneeling and and stretching, yeah, but not to the point that I feel like I've done a bloody marathon today. Crazy. That's the only annoying part about these um, tablets. Do you find that, Willow, if you're still here? Bit naughty to do it across the road, but it don't matter. Yeah, the wife's happy. Do you ever get one of them rooms where, even though I wasn't 100% sure with the colour we had up there, and then when you get the right colour, it's like, wow, yeah, now I realise how wrong that actual colour was. What statins are you taking? I can't remember. Is it the statins that do that, or the blood thinners? Ariel, thank you very much, mate. Yeah, I think it's blood thinners, isn't it? Yeah, joint pain and bruising is a side effect. Yeah, I feel absolutely, like, bodily, totally worn out last night laying in bed. To the point where I couldn't really sleep. I was like, ah, oh, I keep having to move my arms. And it's lovely, you move it, and the... I say pain in inverted commas, it's an ache. The pain goes, and then two seconds later it's back. So you move it down there, it goes. Really weird, yeah. So add that to um, decorating all weekend. By the end of Sunday, honestly, I felt like I'd done, been in a boxing match, you know? I don't have that major sur surgery, Lee, but yeah, I know what you mean. Yeah, I don't sweat. I'm like Andrew, Prince Andrew. I don't sweat. <laughs> I've got to work really hard to sweat, actually. And the same as the other day, like I, I've said to many times, me and my missus used to go to the gym before I started the channel. We was taking, um, is there anything else? No, I don't think so, Joe. It's just a side effect. The, the problem is, if you keep say, taking things to, to ease side effects, you'll end up with more side effects. Sometimes you've just got to accept what the tablets are doing and just live with the side effects. But before I started the channel, me and my wife used to go to the gym together three times, three, maybe four times a week, um, doing this really sort of heavy... It's, it's not boxer size, it's like, um, it was like a Les Mills thing. Anyway, we got it on, on like a subscription now to do it indoors. And that was almost like the last, because I haven't been able to do any exercise for about eight months. Luckily, I'm not a fat pig, because um, I've done fuck all for about eight months. But the last piece of the jigsaw the other night was to do an hour long. It's a hard boxer, uh, no, it's not boxer size, it's um, body combat, they call it. And um, I did it. Uh, absolutely fine uh, it, it felt so good to be able to do it but my god the next day oh god I could barely move 
absolutely barely move. So things like muscle recovery is uh, really extended now. Oh, I'm just going to drive in it. Oh, it's another petrol station, but we can we can discover this. We need to get rid of them question marks on the on on the map anyway. Oh, you're on blood thinners as well, are you, Tony? Yeah, and the joints ache and I bruise easy. Yeah, we're like Natasha Bedingfield. We bruise easy. But it's fine, once you know, you know, you just, like my back at the moment, oh my god, it's not the end of the world. Uh, Wolfrin, no, what for the anti-statin? No, I don't think it is, no, I can't, uh, I think it's got, is that the blood thinner, Lee? I can't remember, I don't take much notice of things like that. I know what the box is, and um, because I kept forgetting my tablets, my lovely wife has taken over the responsibility of my tablets get bloody forgetting which would really frustrate me because I think you prick you've just had the operation why are you forgetting your tablets and then I'd have to rush home and take me blood thinners <clears throat> so yeah it's made me forget even more because she does it now she hands them to me every morning and now I won't forget we'd be driving along and I'd just go fuck and she'd go what's up I've got my tablets. Fuck's sake, how hard is it just to take... Well, I've got to take six now, but how hard is it to remember your tablets? God, they're going to keep you alive for fuck's sake. Why are you forgetting? And I got so frustrated with it, she, she says, well, I'll do it. I mean, they say I've got to take in, um, I've got to stay in the blood thinners and the um, beta blockers for at least a year. It's going to be a bit of a worry, though, isn't it? After the year, oh, after the year. Say, for example, my my operation is successful and it does actually solve it for the whole year. What do you do? Do you just stop taking it? That's a bit of a worry, isn't it? Oh, she does everything for me. Oh, okay, well, oh, yeah. Vitamin D. Right, let's go back and um, get our bell end up. <laughs> Not in that way. If I can remember the way back without any help, it was up here, wasn't it? I think. What a time! What a time! What a time to be alive! No, I do appreciate you all coming in. Thank you very much. It's so nice to be back streaming during the day, pretty much every day now. Okay, Lee. I mean, I can deal with it. Probably as I get older, it might become more of an issue. I can definitely deal with it. It's not, a, you know, I've got stamina like that. If that's what I have to live with, that's what I'll live with. It's better than not being able to walk up the stairs, put it that way. See you later, Glenn. Yeah, it's certainly better than what it was, which was uh, feeling like you're going to have a heart attack every time you, you exert yourself even a tiny bit. So if that's the trade-off, I'm happy with that, it's fine. What a lovely little place this is. I don't know if we're going the right way, we're getting closer to it anyway. What's 
that advertising Fight Club? That's weird. Let's have a look at that. <laughs> Construction Club. <laughs> That's good. I like it. <laughs> yeah, exactly, Jake. Yeah, I'm, I'm quite happy to accept um, side effects if it, if it keeps me alive. Yeah, I'm happy with that. Hello, Carl. How are you? Oh, God, how many hours? I don't know. Loads. Yeah. Um, let me just look on Steam. I'll be able to tell you. Maybe. Um, 40 hours. Um, on the PC version, but I've played the Xbox version, the PlayStation. Yeah, probably about 50 hours in total on this game. Yeah. Which is a lot for me, actually. Yeah, it's a lot. It's be a really good game for me to put that many hours in and stream it that much as well. But there's just something about this. It's very... It's not difficult, is it? Let's be honest. It's not really testing your knowledge as such. It's... It's not like the game's full of recipes, like say No Man's Sky, and you, there's so much to remember. It's pretty straightforward, but I think that's its charm. It's not trying to test you. You can play this almost um, <laughs> almost autopilot in a funny kind of way, and just just enjoy it. It's nice. It's nice. I like it. Oh. <laughs> Hopefully we can actually put it there. I'm sure we can. I'm still... It's, it's a bit weird that this is still included in this job, even though it's on a different location. Hmm. It was just special instructions. Yeah, cool. Yeah, I will get that collectible. Yeah, you're right. In fact, I can just reset that, can't I? We do love a collectible. Eleven. I haven't got that many. Yeah, it should have been a side job. Yeah, I don't understand it. There wasn't much cohesion between two there. No, I don't, don't get it. But we'll take it. It's not a problem. Yeah, that could have been a very, very simple side mission. Yeah, so we're only going to go until about half three, because I've got a tip run to do today. Not a tip run, although they're great. A tip run. Down to the old, um, what would you call it, like a refuge recycling centre if you're not from this country and we call it a tip I suppose that's from the old days where you'd pull up with your car and just tip it into a bloody hole that's what our tips used to be probably yours as well if you're not in the UK it used to be a hole in the ground you'd pull up, reverse your car up and just chuck stuff into a ground terrible really isn't it now it's all about recycling here he is. Oh, what a melodious sound to my ears. Oh, darling. I commissioned this bell myself, you must know. Outstanding craftsmanship, don't you think? And this radiantly fresh forecourt. Now you can at least speak of something like a city hall square again. Glamour and glory, that's what was really missing here. Because you know what the real problem is? <laughs> Tell me. The mayor me. often sets the wrong priorities in her investments. I wish you would listen to me more. It would benefit the city. There's no question about that. Hopefully you and I will meet again soon. Is that the final job? Because that was only on like 90% was it? Yeah, it's done. Another one done. At least we can start the next job to know what we're doing. Cool. Thank you, Harold. His hard drive needs checking. That was cool. Yeah, that was cool. 
So now the next job will be campaign. I think we'll do him and finish the the private um a private the final thing as well. Yeah, let's do that. Right, okay, what we're gonna do is store all of these. We own all of these, by the way. I don't like to rent anything if we can help it. We've got 1.6 mil. Um, oh, these are side missions that have popped up, is it? Okay. Yeah, let's... Uh, let's <laughs> his leg was going funny then. Let's do it. <laughs> American posh accents. Uh, what am I doing? I'm going to jobs. I'm going to campaign. Should we, should we finish... Um, should we finish his and get him ticked off? I think we will. The old bridge is off limits because of the risk of collapse. We need to maintain this important traffic link by building a new bridge as quickly as possible. Yeah, let's do it. Oh, no, 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 no. Put it up to uh, high. We need it on high. Cool. Don't forget to put your job scope over on the left-hand side of your screen up to high before you start. Okay, let's have a look. We're over here, this part of the map. Ah, you have used the favor of the hour. I like yeah, that. Yeah, 46 months. The Thank you very much. The marvelous renovation of the City Hall Square pivoted the public spotlight on myself and resulted in another public interest nice project home. landing in my lap. The big transport bridge at the mouth of the river has recently been deemed in danger of collapsing. Mm. Infrastructure isn't usually in my portfolio, but the urgent nature of the matter means that the transport department head and probably the whole city itself would, in all likelihood, carry me on their shoulders. <laughs> carry me. Immediately <laughs> rebuild the bridge. Yeah, you're a lovely geezer, Harold. Right, what do we actually need? Oh, another collectible down here. <laughs> I know, I like his ear defenders, Alex. It makes me laugh. Right, we need a pallet of metal element elements. Elements? Metal elements, yeah. That's sent here. Yeah, but that's alright, Harold. That's all good, mate. Thank you very much. Right, they're delivered over there. So let's get um let's get physical. Let's get our favourite little um red one out. Came for Elite, you did, yeah, you did. Still good times though, wasn't it? Elite was great. I'll tell you what we will do. Let's let's just Drive up there and get that question mark as well. It's fast travel. Let's go and get this question mark. <laughs> you do get less time for murder, don't you? What about Liz Trust and bloody conservatives going back on what they said? Oh my god. Crazy though, isn't it? I'm not talking about just the, you know, oh, she shouldn't have gone back. I don't mean it like that, but just, God, have they got no bollocks just to stand by what they say? It's unbelievable, isn't it? This country is in a right old shithole, really, isn't it? So annoying. It's sad, really, isn't it? Uh, where is the. Oh, sorry, mate. Oh, we might not be able to get to it. It might be on the other side, actually. Oh, it's another gravel plant. Awesome. Yeah, it's crazy, Jacko. I always dislike it when, um, like, we theoretically um, elect our Prime Minister and then what invariably happens is they have a row 
they do a vote of no confidence and then they vote their own Prime Minister. So Liz Trust, which you've probably seen, isn't sort of my chosen Prime Minister. I don't like it when they do that. If, if the current Prime Minister gets voted out, it should just be a general election. Because otherwise, rather than the millions of people around the country getting to choose, about a thousand MPs did instead. Yeah. It's really fucked up my plans, yeah. <laughs> this might be too far, actually. It might be too far to stretch. It might be. She's not my... I don't consider her my... Prime Minister. Because she wasn't chosen by the people. She was chosen by the people that work there. And we all know what they're like. That part of the world is... It's all a bit fucked at the moment, isn't it? I don't, I don't know what's going on. It don't feel right out there, that's for sure. It feels right in here, though, doesn't it? That's why I like it in here. Because it's nice in here. But then I suppose politics have never been plain sailing, have they? I suppose I would call myself a conservative. I do vote for them. I'm not, you know, not not worried to say that. But I think the best prime minister in our time, and I know you'll disagree. I know you will, and and I know why, and I agree. But I think the current the country flourished. Now, hear me out. I think the country flourished under um, Tony Blair quite a lot. I know he fucked it up in the end of all the bullshit, I know that. But I'm talking purely about the country, like the NHS was fucked, absolutely fucked from the Conservatives. He went in there and he spent lots of money, he did loads of schools. I don't know, I just, I don't know. What do you think? Ah, oh, I can't get it. I'm not saying he's the best, I'm just saying the country itself, forget what happened with the war, the country itself did, did seem to pick itself up a little bit when he was about but you'll probably disagree that's fine we can disagree can't we I'm not saying I even like him I didn't vote for him but my opinion is the country flourished a little bit for the 10 years he was in you're going to heavily disagree aren't you and call me some kind of warmonger I can feel it already God, you're not saying anything. That, that could be bad. <laughs> oh, John Allen Sugar. hit the wall you're too young yeah I'm sure you are Alex yeah it was a while ago now bloody hell I think very soon old Liz will be um, chucked out anyway when the blonde liar came in yeah <laughs> What a time for him to come in, though, with COVID. I mean, you couldn't write it, could you? What the fuck? Perform drilling? What? What are you talking about? Perform drilling? Oh, my goodness. Okay. Right, where are we going to park up neatly? Because you know we want to do this. So we'll park it up all down here, eh? Oh, not in the bloody water. OK, 
Okay, let's go and buy a drill, I'm, I'm guessing. Seems weird to get a massive drill like that at the vehicle dealer. <coughs> Oh, here we go. Big drilling rotary rig. Just the one, isn't there? How much is that? Quarter of a mil? I'll buy that place. I hope that's the right one. Oh, cool. Oh, my goodness. Look at that. Fantastic. <laughs> Definitely, Stephen. I mean, you wouldn't want the job, would you? Yeah, you wouldn't want it. Oh, this would be good. Alright, what's the time? Got to go in uh, about 15 minutes. I would love to stay all day. We can do some more tomorrow, or we'll do something else tomorrow anyway. There'll be two streams tomorrow. The evening um, race stream, we're going to do ACC on PlayStation again, because we just had a lot of fun with that. But we'll do something during the day tomorrow. I don't know if it'd be this. Uh, I'll have to see. I don't, I, I'll wake up and I'll tell you what we're going to play. I've got loads of games to bring you. Loads. Just in case of fitting them all in. What a game though, to be able to get you to do all this stuff. Brilliant, isn't it? Are we, um, we're fracking then, aren't we? <laughs> we're fucking fracking, mate. ACC was very different, uh, decent, sorry. There's, um, there's a few bugs with it. But, overall, bloody hell. Yeah, not bad at all. There's some laughable bugs as well, but we'll talk about that tomorrow. How does it work? Does it... So it doesn't extend out, it just extends down. I've got you. I've got you. Take it, you... Turn. How does that work? Extend... Oh. So that does something with a small hook. I'm not sure what that is. Hmm. Okay. And there's only extent. So how does this actually work? Bus world. No, I don't do any more buses. Yeah. Is that the... Um, that's from the same people, isn't it? That's like the mobile version. No. no. Yeah, it was nice, wasn't it, Stephen? Absolutely nice. Um... How does this work? We haven't got anything to turn up. Extend, retract tracks. Now what though? Well, we're controlling this little thing here. What the bloody hell does that do? Disasters like tsunamis in a bus sim. Well, I've heard it all now. Don't, no, there's no cog. Yeah, the, the only cog is extend and retract tracks. And this, this is not the right drill. Has anyone done this one? Top right. Oh, of course, Donut. Yeah, of course, Sam. What was I thinking? Yeah, what was I thinking? Bloody hell. I was looking for, like... I'll tell you what I was thinking. I was looking for something like turn drilling on. But then, yeah, of course, you got to do that. Yeah, thank you. All right, here we go. Yeah, thank you, mate. No, hang on, hang on. Okay. 
and I guess we've got to empty this one. How do we? En How do we um, empty it? There's one way or the other. Extend. No. You wouldn't have to change it back to drive mode, would you? No, of course not. You have to, uh, yeah, because it's full up over on the the, the top uh, bottom right. It, it's full up, so it needs to go somewhere. How can we? Um, Sam, <laughs> back to you. Yeah, mm, hasn't made that obvious to me. Six percent. Hmm. Driving mode. Oh, was a guess. Yeah, I got you. I got you. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Anyway, um, unless I need might need a truck next to it. I wouldn't have thought so, because you can chuck the, the soil on the ground, can't you? But you might need a truck next to it. But no, how can we get a truck next to it? No, hang on. We can't get a truck sort of next to it anyway, can we? Use the hooks to pick up the pipe sections to make the drill a bit longer. Okay. What does that do though? Well, I'm a bit a bit stunted on this one, which is good. Oh, there's nothing wrong with that. Hmm. <coughs> Yeah, I have seen it, Derek, yeah. Yeah. Draw the other holes first. Okay. Uh, okay, yeah, good idea. The pipe um, of the hook symbol, use that hook to pick them up. Uh, why is it not going up or down there? Thing is, it's green there. Look. Oh. oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. It's filling up or something? I don't know. I still, I'm still not 100 percent sure. We wouldn't have to drill through that now, would we? I can't seem to get the drill bit back down there now. It's like that is, is as low, it'll go up higher, but it won't go lower. Wow. Okay, that's, um... <laughs> oh, hang on, is that like a, is that like a bucket? Do we have to get the next bit on it and drill it down? Is that is that what it is? Oh 
come on, why is it not working now? Two per hole, yeah. Why can't I control the hook now? Right, there we go. I think that's it. Well, as, as usual, we've uh, sussed it out together. Come on. Oh, we can't go back. Then add the next bit, yeah. What, not two bits together, Jerry? Yeah, I don't think it's that then, is it? <laughs> Whoops. Whoops, <laughs> the daisies. Oh, bollocks. Yeah, first symbol I'd line at the bottom, second one to the right. Yeah, put them together and, or, or drill with one. Hmm. Okay, Sam, yeah, we'll try that. Let's get this out of the way. Bloody hell, it reset there. What the fuck? <laughs> it's time to finish anyway. First one put in the ground and then add the second to the first one. No, I, don't, I think you've got to drill in between that, Gary. I was just put off because the dirt was full, as it says over on the right hand side. So, hmm. Well, we'll probably carry this on tomorrow then. <laughs> I, I know, Sam, but I've got a tip run at four o'clock and I've got to load the car up yet. You've got to book in to go to the bloody tip these days. Is the dirt empty? Yeah, the dirt's empty now, yeah. And that's got a weird meter on it, hasn't it? So you're saying drill that? Are you saying drill that? Is that what you're saying? Is it? Uh, no, I don't. I don't. I don't think that's it. Yeah, we just tried adding the second one. It didn't seem to sort of like it. Oh, wait, hang on, hang on. Connect drill pipe. Right. Okay. Now we're doing that. And that fills up with earth, does it? Right. Oh, look, that stayed in the ground. That stayed in the ground. So now we'd be able to put the second one on there, wouldn't we? I think. Now, what do you mean by shake the dirt off? No, I don't. I, I think the dirt went because I reset it. No, I don't want that. I want uh, and then that. Uh, 
Hello, Ricky. How are you? Now that one. Whoops. It's fine. It's just physics. Yeah, you connect the second one. Yeah, yeah, gotcha. And then drill that. Now we should be able to change... Uh, change the mode. Connect that, push that down. So do you think we're going to do this four times and use the same... Because we're only, we're only given two pipes, aren't we, per drill. We're going to use more than that? Hmm. We're going to leave that as a cliffhanger. I know, I'm so sorry. I can hear my missus going out to load the car up, so I want to help her with that. Right, that is it, everyone. Thank you for this little cheeky short uh, construction sim. Um, I'll be back tomorrow. See you later, everyone. Have a lovely evening.